What's up, everybody? How you doing? How's your mama doing? Like, I just did a video about the scandal about the pageant. But, uh, this time I'm to talk about this whole Anton, Antony, Anton Sanchez, the little representative down in, uh, California about the water. And, uh, I saw the video and it kind of messed me up that this guy will whip this kid because he dropped a ball. Antonio, oh, Antonio Sanchez, that's the name. <laughs> and, uh, the funny thing about this is, man, he does it where a neighbor is filming him. You're probably saying, well, he's got nosy neighbors. Like, sometimes it's better to have a camera around, a camera around just in case. Because you don't know what you're gonna catch on film or no on on the camera. Like I did the video about that judge that whipped his child over a computer, but this guy whips his stepson over dropping a football. Now I I don't get it. I really don't get it. Like why would you whip a child over dropping a football? Like I'm gonna show you some of this show you some of this incident now you see Sanchez now you see him beating him look there's Sanchez and there's the boy and he has the belt in his hand there right there. look there he goes again I'm for real He's crying, the boy's crying. And he's whipping him. The boy's mother is not even outside helping him. It, like, I understand punishing the child for, for when they do something bad, but over dropping a football, come, or football or any ball, I don't know. Inside the house? You hear Oscar and his wife talking. All right, listen, just listen. That's enough, fuckstick! That's enough! Me! Yeah, me! I'm having a fucking problem with- Now, ladies and gentlemen, I- Like, this is bad right here. I'm gonna put the- I'm gonna put this video link into the description box, but... I sit here and I listen to this shit, and then it- And I see this shit, and I say, you know what, this is bad business. I say, you're a representative. You work for the government and your bitch ass is sitting up there whipping your child, your stepson out and put out so I, eyes can see. Like all these people get to will watch you whip your son's, your stepson's ass. I, and, and you know what I don't get about it? This is what I don't get about it. And it kind of messed me up. When Oscar Lopez turned the scene, they quit. Why you got like why like for me? I'm glad he did that. That's just a piece of evidence to protect his ass a little bit. So he confronted him about getting off this child. Now, why would like for real though? Now nowadays, you gotta watch what the fuck you really doing when you're out in public too for real because now you know people they got YouTube channels and the camera can record and upload anything you do and I'm pretty much proud of Oscar Lopez <coughs> Oscar Lopez recording this and uploading it because this really needs to be done a public official whipping a child in public abuse that's abuse no he was whipping because of her dropping the ball that's abuse dog I don't give a fuck what you say that's abuse if you beat your child over dropping a ball then your ass needs some jail time dude I'm seeing parents go to jail for just spanking a child why should this fucker get any slack? Why should Antonio Anton 
Antonio or whatever Anton Sanchez whatever the fuck his damn name is get any slack cause he's a public official then you got the boy's grandparents backing up the damn guy and was like oh are you fucking serious your son in law just got caught spanking your grandson in public with a bell because he kept dropping the ball like do you accept that do you like that is that your ordeal where you like to see your grandson getting the shit beat out of him because you think it's fair because he's kept dropping the ball if you think whipping a kid because he dropped the ball I think you should be put in fucking jail that's that's totally fucked up first it was that damn judge whipping his daughter over the fucking computer now it's a public official whipping a child over dropping a ball abuse people see this is why I don't trust our public official cause a lot of people let them backslide and shit when somebody catches the, uh, a public uh, official, a public official on cam, public official on on cam, the first thing they want to do is question the person who filmed it. Oh, why didn't you do anything? Why didn't you do anything? You heard the man confront him. He, he might be in the house, but he confronted him just to get that boy just to get that man off that boy see I don't get see this is one see this is why I don't get man when a public official acts up they get a slap on the wrist and go back to work when a motherfucker like me does some shit like that oh they rather lock my ass up see y'all need to stop see this is why I think they need they need to stop treating public officials like fucking gold and they is worse than dirt And it's bad business that this dude will whip his son's ass just because he kept dropping the fucking ball. Just because he kept dropping the fucking ball. Like, would you whip your child's ass because they kept dropping the ball? Fuck no. It's like, all right, man. Just pick it up and hand it to him. It's like, look. Like, there you go, son. I was like, hey, it's like, you'll get, you get good at it. We just got to practice on it. You throw it back to me and I catch it. I throw it to him. He, if he catch and it bounce out. Hey, I was like, just pick it up, son. We we'll learn, you'll learn, learn how to catch it. Just do time, just do time. But you do not whip a child's ass, cause every, cause he kept dropping the fucking ball. That is bullshit. See, like I said, y'all need to start treating public officials like fucking go and just go on and send his ass to jail. Don't give him no fucking probation. If you can lock up a mother. If you can walk, lock up a common black person or a common white person or a common Latino or a common Asian person for child abuse, you can lock up a public offense, you can buy a public uh, rep whatever, you can lock Sanchez up for whatever, you can lock, if you can lock a common person up for child abuse, you can lock his bitch ass up for child abuse, it may, does not make any difference, just because he got changed, got uh, more changed in his pocket than I do, does not make him any different, he bleeds the same color of blood as I do, just because he's high ranked, just because he's up and got good money, does not make him better than nobody, I see this is why it gets fucked up. Y'all let these damn public officials get away with so much. Oh, they stealing money and they buying cars. They spending your tax paying money to buy them cars. They spending that I'm not talking about their fucking paychecks. I'm talking about the tax money that goes into the into the government. They reaching in, grabbing, pulling out, and spending. But th this is how y this is how y'all want y'all government to be, where they get to walk around beating the shit out of kids. If you want that, go ahead, keep voting for motherfuckers like you, so they can walk up in your house, beat the shit out of your kids, where they can't want no more. Then roll out and take your money, cause that's all it is, man. 
Oh, we love him, Mr. Sanchez. He's a great person. Oh, he took care of us when we was in need. Then you got little Timmy sitting in the back with black eyes, broken jaw, busted lip, nose bleeding, broken arm, got his leg in the cast. Can't even, you only got a nub just to write in what happened just because he fucked little Timmy up in the back. That's, I'm telling you, man, motherfuckers today, man. Just don't get it. <laughs> People, did, this is what makes no sense is how the grandparents of this boy is taking up for him. They let this motherfucker out on board. If he got arrested Friday, anybody knows the justice systems on how they work on the weekends. He wouldn't have got out until Monday morning. How come he got out the same day he got locked up? That mother doesn't make no sense. Like I said, I don't give a fuck who he is. I don't give a fuck what his job title. If he can be the child for a little something, something so petty, he can get his ass whipped while he's in the jail cell. Do not baby this motherfucker. Do not sit there and let him get away with child abuse. If you let this motherfucker get away with child abuse, then that means every uh, every person in this fucking world can get away with child abuse. Just because these fucking people did not press charges on this man. See, that's all it is. When you let these public, public officials get away with so much, that's telling the American people, oh, if they can get away with it, I can get away with it. Oh, if the public, if the popo said, "Oh no, you can't do that," well, you just let this motherfucker rob two banks, take my money, beat the shit out of a child, beat the shit out of a child, shoot somebody in the face, and yeah, self defense, and walk the fuck away. How come? How come you let him do all that, but I can't do that? I said he don't pay your seller. I pay your shit. That call you right in, that's my money paying your shit. And that's all it is to it. Do not let this let these public officials fool y'all. I'm telling you, man, I'm glad that this Oscar Lopez recorded this shit because if it wasn't for him, this story never break. See, this is a story that doesn't have to do with race doesn't have to do with black, white, Chinese, Puerto Rican, whatever, but it is what it is. This man abused this child because he kept dropping the ball, but it, may, but it makes no sense to how he can walk away. It's like, well, they said, oh, well, they, they said they, more, they got more details later and all this and that. No, no, no. When they say more details later, that's a fucking sign saying this fucker's about to get off. <laughs> Just watch. If this Sanchez motherfucker gets off from child abuse and don't even spend a month in jail or a year in jail or something like it, or fucking get on, like, fuck that damn probation shit. <laughs> fuck the probation, fuck the ankle brace. This motherfucker need jail time. If he doesn't do jail time and he gets away with beating the shit out of this kid, then that tells everybody in this fucking country that they are allowed to beat the holy hell out of their kids because y'all let a public figure get away with child abuse. That's how I see it. If a child, if a public figure can beat the shit out of a, a kid, then walk away from a fucking child child abuse charge then they're telling us we can break the laws just as well as the public officials if y'all if the police say no well you, you could have did something about the public official to beat the shit out the kid now if if he didn't beat the shit out if you didn't arrest him and that motherfucker would never if he would have got some jail time maybe this little incident would never let him but it happened. Don't play favorites here. Just because he's got money doesn't mean shit. 
If you let him do it because he put a little money in your pocket, I can too, and I'm going to kick your ass. Oh, man, I'm telling like it is, man. These people just don't understand. When I was a kid, my mom spanked us when we acted up. Now, that's teaching a kid a lesson. When you act up, you get punished. Fuck that time out shit. When you act up, you get punished for acting a fool or getting into trouble. But when you drop a ball, if you drop a ball, then I don't think, yo, I don't think, if you drop a ball, I don't think whipping somebody's ass because of that, man. That's it's just a little bit too extreme to do all that shit, man. It really is too much extreme. A public official, California official, beating stepson, felony charge. No, for real. For real, though. This is bullshit. How can he can get away with so much? I'm for real, though. How, how do you get away with that shit? That's one thing, I'm really fucked up on that shit, that these people would let this man get away with a whole bunch of bullshit because he's a public official, California official, like for real though, let him, I'm for real man, let him spend some jail time and, and, and shit, fire his bitch ass, let him go sit off in the jail cell somewhere, let the fucker get booty raped. That's all that is. I don't give. I don't give it like for real, man. It's all about that paper. It's all about that paper. It, that's what it is. Yeah, I gotta think about it. Oh, he dropped the ball. He deserved to get. No, no, he doesn't. If he dropped the ball, that does not deserve an ass whooping. I deserves like. I deserve like. Okay, son, you dropped the ball. You're gonna get good at it as we keep on practicing. We're gonna practice. And then once you start practicing and you're getting good at it, that's it. Then you don't have to worry about nothing. You'll be the best player on your team. Not the best player, but you and your team will be the best. But uh, that's how it is. You don't beat the shit out of a child just because he kept dropping the fucking ball. Because he kept dropping the fucking ball. Ladies and oh man, Lord, screaming, Lord Jesus. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Afro Joe Ten, like a T I is. Subscribe to my channel, see Lord, No, follow me on uh, follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, see Lord Junior Two and see Lord Junior Three. If you like what I got to say, leave it in the comment or a video response. Or if you don't like what I got to say, you can kiss my ass and burn in hell for all I care. Peace, y'all.